Alright guys, we are back again with another episode of China Tech. This time is episode number two. We'll be unboxing all those China related products and see how good they are and I mean how good is it in terms of their unboxing and their packaging and so on and their product quality. So let us just get started. So this is a selfie stick here that I got. I got it very very cheap actually, it's very cheap. And let's take a look at the packaging. So we can see here they say here three generations drive by wire, okay and so it's, this is 78 cm long and you can bend up to 270 degrees so selfie stick and it's saying integrated foldable smart uh, shooting aid which is kind of interesting and let's see over here best capability and steadily provided by third generation chipset what? there's a chipset in this thing? huh okay quality is alive and on this side which is showing us how long the selfie stick can extend and at the back here, let's take a look closer. So three generations drive-by wire, which I think is it the brand name or something. All right. So the instructions here. Let's take a look at the English side. Instructions. So pre-principle. Okay, the misspelling error there. Using the headphone cable to touch off the photo button. Huh? What do they even mean? Touch off the photo button. Huh? Let's continue on. Be attention. Actually, it should like it means it should they should mean uh, for your attention or something like that, not be attention. Anyways, continue. Before buying this product, please com confirm confirm. <laughs> Very nice English. The volume key of your phone can take pictures or set volume lee huh, type whatever to take pictures. So I think this is for Android. So you have to change your settings to volume key. I'll show you guys that later. And apply to. A plea, a plea to iOS 5.1 above system, Android, <laughs> Android 4.2 above system. Actually, it means Android. But I don't know why they mean it ever there. For iOS system, you don't need to set it up. So they mean here means uh for iOS, you don't have to do anything. Just plug it in. You can take selfies already. So for Android system, you may set up your phone camera setting volume key, set up the volume key to take pictures. So they're just teaching you how to use it on Android to set it up on Android devices. So yeah, and they're also warning us here that some Android devices can't be set. You can download the app like Camera 360 to take pictures. So I think some phones, um, besides the Samsung phones, some maybe can't take using the volume keys. So they might have to use a third-party application to take photos, which is, which is what they're trying to say. So a lot of mistakes in the instructions, but take a look at the Chinese part, I'm going to show something funny here. So you can see here they spell it wrongly, ISO 5, it should be iOS, what is got, what's ISO going to do with an operating system. Anyway, and here they spell it correctly, which is Android 4.2, which is correct on the Chinese, uh, the Chinese version of the instructions, but over here on the English version is spelled wrong, it's kind of funny, but I just want to shout it out you guys. So yeah, selfie stick and me in China, obviously. So let's uh, unbox this guy here. So let's take a look. This one is uh, blue in color. There are many colors I think, but this is the blue one I got. Okay, let's take it out. So that's it. This is the selfie stick directly. And here we have the headphone jack which, which, you, which you're supposed to plug to your device, which I'll show you guys later. So we can extend like this, 270 degrees, which is correct and we can extend it so you put your phone over here you can lift it up like this and once you're ready you just extend it yep there we go there you go you can extend it up to 80, 78, meter, 78 centimeters so very nice all right let's just put it back for now to show you guys how it works or not so i'm gonna get a phone i'll be right back Alright guys, I have my Galaxy Note 4 here, so we can test a big phone here just for testing purposes. So this is a 5.7 inch display. As you can see, we can fit it, no issue. And we can use this over here to tighten the phone, just turn it to the right. It's tightened and this is your headphone jack. Oh wait, headphone jack is here, so we have to extend it here. And there we go, we have plugged in the device, so let's go to camera mode. And you can see, so to set it on Android, you just gotta go to settings, as they said, uh, it is, and they ask us to go to volume key. You see, this Samsung device has an option to uh, take pictures using the volume key, which will be beneficial for this selfie stick. You can just press the button. You see my hand here. 
and let's see does it take yep it does take you see the blink yep it works so yeah it works the selfie stick works without any issues for the note 4 all right so let's just close everything back Alright guys, so that's all for the unboxing for this selfie stick. What do I think of this thing? It's pretty okay. I mean, for the price that I paid, it's pretty cheap. And yeah, this is be my selfie stick I'll be using. It's very good. And yeah, so that's all. Thanks so much for watching this uh, quick uh, unboxing of this China product selfie stick, or you can call it third generations drive by wire. <laughs> It's kind of funny. Anyway, that's all for this video. Thank you guys for watching this uh, quick unboxing. And stay tuned for more China Tech re uh, related videos in the next episode. Coming very shortly, hopefully. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.